because the mural is a representation by a white person of black people, white people, and native people here in Kentucky. It's a historical object. It represents more about the time it was created in rather than the objective reality of the history of Kentucky. And so we need somebody else's reality to be reflected in art. Not correct it, not overly you know, make up for it in some way, but to start a bigger conversation about these things. We need to have the mural be a source of dialogue and an opening of a conversation rather than a closing of conversation. And so I hope that what the work that the committee did and what the outgrowth of those efforts are going to be are the beginning of something that is much more pervasive, that it doesn't just stop with the mural, but that it begins to uh, infuse itself through many, many spaces at the university. This will prompt more questions about where we were, who we are today, what we want to be, where we want to go together as community. This is the great thing that art does, is it puts us in touch with ourselves, and it puts us in touch with others.